Hello guys, this is Brian back with the Hedera Hashcraft HBAR token update. I'm going to show you guys things in a couple minutes here. We have been uh, waiting for a move out of this thing for uh, for a while now. It feels like forever, okay? I'm going to show you guys things that are definitely absolutely pointing to some price action and uh, most likely, you know, not financial advice at all, but... Uh, most likely a move up for sure in these charts so i'm going to get back to this in just a second and uh i'm, I'm going to show you guys some things that are going to get you excited here okay i know it's been a little bit of a downer here since we came up here and topped out at uh you know almost eight cents and we got rejected back here to roughly six and a half okay but just hang in there all right that's all i ask uh you know a lot of these coins you just got to have patience and that's what kills people you know it's uh Sometimes it can take forever for things to play out, it feels. But if you haven't yet, please hit that subscribe button. We would love to have you here every day and uh, you know, try to get this, this stuff out as soon as I can for you guys. And I appreciate all the support. And uh, we do a giveaway every month, and we would love to have you a part of the group. So please come join us. But here's the top articles today out there in, in crypto. New York regulator could set world standard for crypto. Uh, Singapore is working with banks to provide guidance on crypto businesses. Uh, down here it says Japanese political faction signals potential thaw in crypto winner. And of course Dogecoin and uh, Shiba Inu down there. But that, that's the big things going on today. Also, happy birthday Satoshi Nakamoto. Uh, 48th birthday according to the the P2P Foundation profile that they made. He had a birth. He or she or they had a birth date of April 5th, 1975. I'll show you a picture of that profile picture right here. A 48 year old male from Japan. So when they uh, first launched, that's the profile they made. And uh, congratulations and happy birthday to whomever you are. That uh, whoever, whoever, what group you are, because. Uh, you should be very proud of what you did, that's for sure. Here's the uh, top 100 on the crypto bubbles for the day. You can see uh, not a whole lot of green out there. Just going sideways. Bitcoin cannot break that uh, 29,000. Jeez, oh man, hold on if it does, you know. That's what we're waiting and waiting for here. The Crypto Fair and Green Index market cap is flat, okay. Volume is down 12.7% over 24 hours. Bitcoin dominance has moved up 0.37%. Uh, and in market sentiment, we went up one click to a 63. We were at a 62 yesterday. Here's your top gainers and losers for the day. Uh, you can see Dogecoin up there doing a correction. And, uh, it goes down through these a little slow for you. They're on the this the top 50 coins, I believe. I never really counted them all, but you know, 25 or 30 on each side. That's the bottom. All right. So there's them, and let's get into this chart, guys. This H bar chart because this thing has been driving me crazy. All right. First off, let's put a fib on that thing, and you can see we are right down at that 702. I totally believe we have bottomed out. I do not believe we are going to go lower than that. Not financial advice. We're going to take this line and double that up. So uh, I am stuck to the word of saying that now. But I don't believe this thing's going to come down any further. We have super support there. These RSIs are just ready to go. Look down at the bottom here. Okay. These relative strength indexes, traders rely on these things, okay? They show when the market is oversold or overbought. And when they're at the bottom and we're getting ready to head up, you know, that lot of, that is uh, like right over here when this run started, okay? That RSI was at the bottom. You can see as I move up the arrow, that's when it got to the top up there. And then we had our pullback right here, okay? And then it had another little run and our pullback went back down. And another little run and then our big pullback here and it's gone flat there okay we had that little bump right there but nothing major on that four hour all right let's move on to the other ones let's go to the eight look at that i think it is down at the bottom the 12. once again down at the bottom these things are uh, just all aligning perfectly the daily is is right about there but look at the curve look at that thing you could tell it's starting to curve it's not straight down this can, thing can curve and head right back up that daily 
So let's get, uh, let's, I think the one and the four might, I'm not sure. The one is at the top. That's fine. That thing, uh, that thing goes up and down all day. The two and that four. Okay, so the four, the eight, and the twelve are all perfectly reset. Okay, that twelve especially. All right, look over here. That's when that big run started right here when that thing was at the bottom. And then you can see it went up and it can stay up at the top for a little while. You know, just like it did over here. It can stay up there for a minute before it comes down. But when it starts down, you know, it, uh, you can have your big pullbacks. So this thing looks perfect. Looks ready to go. We put, uh, I put them uh, targets up there the other day for this thing. And them are uh, right lined up with the fact. We unlock these real quick with that box where I want it here right at that 618 and that 702 right there that's where I expect this first area to be you know then it's going to make up its mind if we're going higher or not you know this could take a day or two to play out or three days not financial advice at all please 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 do your own research with that stuff but look at that thing just starting to curve and come up it's just about flat line down there so all right, guys, thank you so much. I'll be here waiting for, we have a 12-hour green candle here. So I'm waiting for this thing to go. We're only down 1.5% today. And we have major, major support where we're at here. So this thing, uh, you can see back through here, has been a major support area. All right, so I will keep an eye on this. Please hit that subscribe button, guys. And thank you so much for watching my video. I very much appreciate it.